Hi everybody, it's fun with puns time. <laughs> but before we start, of course, if you could subscribe and if you haven't already done it, that'd be great, thank you. And also, ring that little bell icon if you want to know what's coming up next. Okay, well our fun pun character today is a rocking horse. <laughs> okay, uh, I'm going to start with the shades. So start like this, that kind of shape there. And I'm going to draw on pun in the old piano. And that's side of the shades there coming up at an angle. Seeing him from the side, okay? Above that, you'll get his ear coming in like that. And then, of course, you have to make this into a rocker, so his hair would turn into a, a quiff like that, okay? And his mane would come down like that into a kind of a old 50s rock and roller hairstyle cutting up like that. And of course, you have uh, the sideburns coming down like that. Okay, and the front of his uh, front of his face uh, comes down like this over his nose, that kind of shape there, and then round in a big grin with a couple of big horsey, goofy teeth sticking out, and a nice big smile like that, and then the back of the head coming up. There, okay, and then the curve of the of the long neck coming down there. <laughs> okay, looking good. Now we have his costume. He's sitting at the piano, so first of all, I would draw his collar, and then his back leaning forward slightly, so his back coming in like that, and uh, his arms are kind of outstretched, coming forward like that. Okay, turning out a great rock and roll riff, and the jacket. These. Rock and roll jackets are called drape jackets, I think. So we're nice and long, and then the curve coming up. Enjoying that one there. Then you see his back coming in, and then the legs appearing, come coming from there underneath the jacket, and coming down, bending backwards like that, down to a turn up. And his jeans, you see every bit of the, of the light coming in there. And of course he has the old blue suede shoes. Look at that. A bit of the sock. And then the top of the shoe coming in there like that. And the crepe soles. <laughs> okay. And this other, now you'll see it coming appearing in there like that. And uh, Back of that shoe coming in there, the sole, and then the toe of that one appearing about there. He's sitting on a, a very simple stool shape, you just draw a kind of curve like that. And the other legs appearing in there, okay? And his hands on the old Joanna. Very simple, cartoon style type hands. Another hand coming in here. Like that, okay. Now the piano itself, of course, he is kicking up a storm on this one. So, uh, you know, make it look as if it's bouncing and jumping about, you know, under the onslaught. <laughs> That's the side of it. And then this part coming up here. So we have to stick to the straight lines because, you know, we are creating a, a kind of funny sensation here of uh, the piano being pounded. So you can draw that at the keyboard with the lines coming up like that and the black keys maybe even jumping out of the sockets, you know, <laughs> like this. And coming in there. And the back of the piano comes up like that. And it would curve along there. And maybe the, the bit where you sit the music on would appear like that. Okay, and then the side of the piano, and a kind of grand, a baby grand piano coming down like that, with the, the curve going around, you know, and the other side of it coming in there, the, one of the back legs there, the wheel on it, the front legs here, and these two pedals coming in there, like that, okay? And the, the lid will be open, 
a lot on that lovely music to come flooding out. <laughs> Another line come out there at the edge, and then propped open by a stick shape like that. Okay, and you could add to the sensation by putting in things like musical notes like that. And a few lines to suggest. Oh, have I got his tail? Is that like that? Okay. And as I said, a few of these lines to suggest the, the music being pounded out. Okay, what we do now is, of course, just uh, fill in the dark shapes of his quiff and his hair. Okay, we've done the hair, and I move on to the uh, Color now, that's that would be black. By putting in these bits of black, it makes your drawing a bit more graphic. Okay, it makes it stand out that bit more. Excellent. So, I hope you enjoyed that first uh, drawing of a crazy pun, a rocking horse. <laughs> okay, I hope you can join me again for another tutorial. But in the meantime, of course, all the best and happy drawing.